Hi Makeup Addicts, today is my five year wedding anniversary and to celebrate I wanted to recreate my wedding makeup look. I actually brought down my uh, bindi that I wore on my wedding day and this is a very similar look although not exact because I didn't do my wedding makeup uh, unfortunately. And this is how I would have done it however and as you can see it's got beautiful colours, very vibrant, very bold, gold, bronze, copper and uh, the traditional mahogany, um, not mahogany sorry, burgundy lips. So uh, if you like the look please stay tuned for the tutorial. Right, to start with, I've already applied my Urban Decay Primer Potion. You can use Too Faced Shadow Insurance. And I've also applied concealer over the eyelid to hide any discoloration. And now I'm going to use Benefit's Busy Signal. And this is a bronze base. Uh, you can use Indian Wood from MAC. Um, and I'm going to apply it with my fingers. And I'm just going to apply it in a passing motion. I'm going to do my brows now actually because um, I like to have them done before the eye makeup is applied. I just find it easy to work with and also it helps guide me when I'm applying the eye makeup. So what I'm going to use is my Too Faced Brow Envy Kit and I bought that from ASOS.com and I'm just going to use a template from the kit and it's the Girl Next Door kit, um, Girl Next Door template. And what I normally do is I apply this on top of my eyebrow and I use my own eyeshadow for this because I just find this colour matches my skin, my, my eyebrow better and I'm just going to apply it with a sponge applicator. Right, I'm going to actually start with the highlighter and I'm going to use white uh, eyeshadow and this is a slightly frosty eyeshadow from Too True and I'm just going to apply it with a flat brush I mean you can use anything that you're comfortable with I just want to just get it on really and this helps me control the colour so it stays under the brow and not on the brow that's why I'm using it Right, the next step is to just put um, some more bases on my skin before I apply the actual eyeshadow and I really want the gold to pop because the, the dress colours are really vibrant and really bright so what I'm going to use is a base and this is from number 17 and it's metallic pencil in gold and I just find if I apply this underneath the eyeshadow it will just make that colour more true, more true gold if you already have a gold base, you don't need this colour, but this is what I'm using. I'm just going to apply that quite generously on the eyelid. Just the eyelid, uh, about halfway. And I've got the bronze colour, this is optional, you don't have to use it if you don't want to. But I'm going to use that on the outside. Yeah. Right, now I'm going to use a bronze colour eyeshadow, and this is from my Prestige palette and this is Beauty Bar Camouflage and uh, it's just a bronze colour and I'm going to use a fluffy brush here and apply that in the crease and then I'm going to blend it with the uh, other colours. Now we've got the base colours on I'm going to start using the eyeshadows and this is um, number 10 and it's yellow gold from Barry M and Barry M I'm going to be using quite a bit of because their colours are amazing and if you haven't checked them out look at their website uh, barrym.com I think it is and I'm just going to pat the colour on because I want it to really come out I want that colour to come out right, next I'm going to use a bronze colour from Barry M this is colour number 44 and it just looks like this I'm going to use a flat shader brush because I want to get the colour on as much as possible. Now Indian brides um, often wear red, that's the traditional colour. Um, not always, I didn't wear red on my wedding day although I wished I had them. I wore a bronzy pinky colour, in fact I've got the bag here just to show you what colour it was and the amount of detail and just time and effort that goes into making these amazing outfits 
and that's why when you wear the makeup it has to be over the top because the dress is over the top and the jewelry is over the top anyway I'm going to use a maroon color and this one is actually um, my cheek color that I used and it's Hushabai from MAC and I'm going to use the ang um, angle brush I'm just going to apply that 